several conflicting and inconsistent proposals have been made by the USSR within the last 24 hours, including the one just made public in Moscow. The proposal broadcast this morning involves the security of nations outside the Western Hemisphere. But it is the Western Hemisphere countries, and they alone, that are subject to the threat that has produced the current crisis. The action of the Soviet government in secretly introducing offensive weapons into Cuba. Work on these offensive weapons continues at a rapid pace. The first imperative must be to deal with this immediate threat under which no sensible negotiation can proceed. It is therefore the position of the United States that as an urgent preliminary to consideration of any proposals, work on the Cuban bases must stop. Offensive weapons must be rendered inoperable. Shipment of offensive weapons to Cuba must cease, all under effective international verification. As to proposals concerning the security of nations outside the hemisphere, the United States and its allies have long taken the lead in seeking properly inspected arms limitation on both sides. These efforts can continue as soon as the present Soviet-created threat is ended. 